Welcome to week number 77. 77. I like that number. What's the bingo equivalent of that? I don't know. I don't think we're good enough at bingo to be doing Legs the bingo kicking, thing. Kicking 77. No, definitely not. Some bright light. Woo! All night arm decay foundation, lads. Looking good. Is this the start of the vlog? Yeah. Listen to how cl uh, choked up that sound. I oh, know, you don't sound very good. Oh. I think I'm catching whatever you've got. I feel sh weird. She's got a head cold. It's just a head cold this time. Not a mad clue. Today is actually Sunday. The vlog's going up in 49 minutes. Filming early because we've got another week at home, but we've got another busy week at home. We're just getting loads of work out the road before we're back in our travels of 2018. We're in the ding, car. Ding, 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 ding. There's Droggy boy. Hello, buddy. He looks absolutely depressed. He looks like we don't feed him or something. But really, we're going to the park. He's just pissed off that he's not at the park right now. We're getting cozy. It's November. Officially festive season. Officially Christmas time. Officially time to be jolly and happy and merry. Unless you've got yeah, SED because cold, the weather's and shite cold, and, and, cold. And, choked up the cold. and choked up the cold. I actually do feel quite tired today, but that's probably because I woke up at half past six this morning to go to PT. I've not been not well in ages. Pitch wood. <sighs> That was one of my unique selling points was the fact that um, the t-shirts that say I'm not well and them were in void. I think the last time I was not well was like this time last year and I had the exact same thing, just a build up of... Are you feeling really shite? Cold in my head, yeah. But you must feel alright because you're dragging me out to go for a walk. <gasps> we're going to the I think the winter air will help my sinuses. Okay. Or the autumn air rather. And I get it's winter. Walk. Gloves. They're not driving gloves. We bought these gloves to go to Iceland and we only had to use them for one thing and they're not waterproof so they were useless. But this is the first time I've ever... You'll wear them in New the York car. and... Um... This is the first time I've ever... Oh my god! Stop it! I'm it! I'm over it. I'm going to film when we get to the park. Bye guys. walk with the dog. We were home for a wee bit and now, now we're going to the cinema to see Bohemian Rhapsody. We're both very excited about it. Are you excited? Yeah, I can't Yes, wait. he is excited. <laughs> <laughs> what? And then I just realised, I just remembered Radio Tomorrow. BBC Scotland. BB, it's actually Radio 1. I bet it's BBC Scotland Studio. BBC Scotland Studio in Glasgow. I'm recording a radio show. I am taking over Radio 1. I don't know how this all this stuff's happening to me. I don't know why people think it's a good idea to, for anyone else to record me or put a camera on me. I do not know why this is happening. Because you're hilarious. But that'll be good though. Tomorrow we're doing it at 11. So it's only 5 o'clock just now we're going to the cinema. So I need to go home. I need to wash my hair even though it's radio. I still need to have clean hair. Um, and then that's what, that's what we're doing tomorrow. So we're just having a wee Sunday. The vlog went up. I like reading all your comments. When the vlog goes up at 4 o'clock on a Sunday, I am always online. Creeping. Creeping on you. Remember this area? Yeah. We used to live here in this area we're in just now. It's called Toe Cross. We lived in Toe Cross. It's called Toe Cross. Adjacent to Parkhead. 
Yeah, we used to live here. It's weird. Remember the tiny wee flat? That was... I don't think we vlogged in that flat, did we? We started weekly vlogging the week we moved into the new house. So we did. But I vlogged yeah, sometimes. some of the videos. Some of the videos. Done, all yeah. the mad backdrops. I used to film in my kitchen. Yeah, and then I, I, used to, I used to film in the living room as well. <laughs> mad, isn't it? Remember guys, a tiny wee flat. But we're back in that area because Bohemian Rhapsody sold out up EK because EK is the best cinema in the world. Parkhead Forge, woo! If you know, you know. <laughs> if you don't know, don't worry. Actually sick. I woke up this morning feeling pretty terrible. Um, I've got a big full face of makeup on because I'm going to be on the radio. Makes absolutely zero sense. Um, we're just on our way to the BBC, which is on. It's like right in the middle of Glasgow, and I'm recording a radio show. It's um, Radio One Takeover by me, and it's going to be on at a really unsociable hour. But if you guys want to listen to it, I'm sure it's going to be on BBC iPlayer or Radio One's iPlayer, is that a thing? By the time it goes live, I'll just put on Twitter the link if you guys want to listen. My music taste is eclectic, so I think people are going to like it, but I've got really weird, I think I've got quite weird music taste, and by that I mean that I just like a lot of stuff. Like the list, I basically had to choose a list of 18 songs, 17 made the cut, and yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna play them for you guys. I'm excited. I think it'll be fun. I don't know if it's gonna be something that I'm gonna be good at, but you know you never know until you try. Then we're gonna go and get a little bit of lunch. It's Monday, but I'm actually I'm sorry, I know you're feeling shy, but I actually feel quite good. <laughs> I'm very excited about my makeup because this foundation is all nighter by Urban Decay and I used to use this somewhat frequently. But I forgot how good it is, and I'm starting to properly trial makeup for the wedding. You are listening to the Radio One Takeover with me, Jamie Genevieve. Is that good? Yeah, perfect. Absolutely great. Will I just read through all of these? Yeah, please. Okay. This is Jamie Genevieve and you're listening to my Radio One Takeover. I remember walking into Asda and this was the first album I ever bought. We're going to be playing some bloody great music and you're going to love it. Hi guys, it's me. We're just in the house, we're just relaxing. We're gonna watch Lay Through. I thought I would just pop on here to show you my foundation. I've had this on for 12 and a half hours. This whole makeup, I've not touched up once. I think it looks quite good. I'm gonna do another test. I haven't been the best today. Like, I've been touching my face a lot and I've been cuddling drug, but when I say I've been cuddling drug, but I mean I've had my face in his fur. Yeah, I've just been like living life. So for me, touching my face loads, I think it looks really good. I am not shiny whatsoever. It's nuts, but I'm just gonna take my makeup off. We're gonna relax, watch the way through. I'm so tired, I think I'm getting sick. Guys, I think I've, I've jinxed myself. Yesterday I said I've not been sick in ages, and I do not feel great today. Like, as soon as we got home from BBC, I started feeling really bad, and now I just feel a bit ugh. So we'll see what happens tomorrow morning. I've got PT tomorrow at 10.45, so we'll see how that goes. I am, in this moment in time, I'm definitely going, but, hmm. Me and the girls are on the couch. Oh. I've honestly looked like this for, for three days. This is me now. Me and Charlotte are just getting a wee bit of work done. I've filmed a couple of things, Jack's editing. Honestly, I've not got much to update you. I bought a new carpet today, which is quite exciting. Got a new TV unit. Look, do you not think it goes so much better? It's from TK Maxx. Wait, that's quite bright. There it is, dark. So look at my nail, I've lost one nail. Yesterday I went to the Bell Farm and got more Botox in my jaw because my masseter muscle, which is this one, is really, really strong. So I got a double dose, um, so I got an another dose of it because what it does is it stops me from clenching my jaw. Oh. So see that? Mmm, it's working! Mm. Starting to work. Thought I was starting to get sick, but I've been taking B propolis tablets, which are great. My mum made me take them and they stopped me from getting sick. So I've been taking B propolis tablets. I'm feeling much better. And honestly, I've just been kind of like slowly working on bone stuff that I can't talk to you about, obviously. I've it down and it's not coming back up for enough, you 
Me and Charlotte went to Silverburn, forgot to film anything. Um, we went and picked up an Andos for me and Jack. Um, we've got a power cut. We've got a really bad power cut, the whole house. I've been sitting there for the last hour in complete darkness. Has it been an hour? I've had one candle in. <laughs> Jack, when, when, I, when I pulled up in the car, Jack, Jack had just been sitting uh, in the window looking out like, what's going on? I told you to get the, the basketball bat. I phone Scottish power. Basket <laughs> I phone Scottish power. Where's the basketball bat? I phone Scottish power and they said it'll be down until 12. Right, so what time is it now? It's only nine. Nine. We've got three hours of out power. Uh, but do you know what I was thinking? I'm going to turn this off. <gasps> Play hide and seek in the dark. That's scary. I'm nervous. We've got a torch on top of a glass there, which is good. Good, good, good. That's better, isn't it though? Yeah. You're terrible. The first thing Jack did was phone me and go, Jimmy, we've got the power cut. <laughs> I was no, like, no, 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 I've been around chopping no, the neighbours, they're not answering, no, what's happening? That, no, I phoned you and I said, there's a power cut just so you know when you get back home. <gasps> no, you me, said, no. Jamie, what do I do? No, no, no. <laughs> and then no. I was like, well, I'm in Silverburn, no, what do you want me to do? No, no, no. This is not what happened. Yes, it is. No, I was just pre warning you. But do you know what I was thinking we could do? We can use my phone in hotspot, the laptop, and watch Netflix in the dark yeah, with no. candles on. Do you think that sounds great fun? That'll bash some data. Nah, I don't care. Droba doesn't like torches. <laughs> Droba, it's only a source of light. Are you scared? Are you scared? Do you want to stay and play? Or do you want to go home to your nice lighthouse? Should we st I'm away. I'm, I'm, I'm away. Oh, our besties! What's this? Uh, what's that? Hey, look at that! Oh, it looks like a turtle. Mine's yeah, is a wee deer. What's that? Kangaroo. Oh, bah! <laughs> oh. I'm going to go and eat my dinner. And then I'll update you when we get power. Or what's maybe that? even before that. But what if it becomes an adventure? Oh. <laughs> this is how we're eating dinner. <laughs> I think my nando's are pitch black. And it's cold as well. I'm gonna have a chip. Do you know what we'll do? We'll eat. And then I'll go and get some candles or something and make it nice and we'll watch a film. Job is absolutely unfazed. Job can see in the dark. I can't. Dog can't see in the dark. How do you know? Me and Jack have to go into rooms at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> With this one torch I'm we've got. Go to the bathroom and clean up. Right, I need to brush my teeth. <laughs> you don't realise how good Lecky is until you don't have it. Can I not have a shower? What? Can I not have a shower? No, it'll be freezing cold to the boiler and stuff electricity. No! What? I'm not ready. Jack, don't leave. I need wash my hands. You're too slow. I need to pee. Okay. But I can't pee without the light. What are you doing, little man? <laughs> Look, I just did I just got hand cream instead of soap because I couldn't see. It's like the Blair Witch Project or something in here. So I was a makeup artist for a long time and people, when you're a makeup artist, it's obviously it's almost like a similar thing but in your real life, like face to face life, I would be using products that people would really love and then I would tell them what it was and they would go and get it. It's exactly the same thing but now it's online. So my following started growing because people started to like the photos I was putting out. So it was different makeup looks and then whenever we would travel, I would put photos up of that and people wanted to know where we were and where we were staying and things like that. But I honestly, I just think it's the exact same thing as when I was a makeup artist because I was just so excited about makeup and beauty that when I had a product that I thought worked brilliantly, I would use it on people and explain why I loved it so much. And it was just like a YouTube video, but in, in real life. So it just kind of carried on naturally from that. Uh, I remember I was invited um, overseas. I was invited out to LA and I wasn't going to be able to go because I had clients booked in. So I made the decision to say to my clients that I was going to be leaving. Everyone was really, really nice about it. Everyone was excited for me. A few people knew it was coming. They were wondering when I was going to be leaving to pursue this career full time. And then since then I've not really looked back. I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to do it full time, but it's snowballed nicely and now I'm really busy with it, which is great. So various companies will say... Hello, it's me. And I forgot to explain what that last bit was, so I'm just editing the vlog just now and I thought I'd pop on here and explain. So I was on the radio again. I do not know why everyone wants me to go on the radio. I don't think I can be trusted. I was on the radio talking about my work. It was cool. It was good. Yeah, it's been a great week full of work and also a little bit of chill because Jack and I, me and Jack, are going to be travelling um, for the next two weeks. We've got a trip each week. We've got a few days in between. I need to pack today. I've got a busy day tomorrow. And yeah, I'm just really excited. This is the last crazy spell of 2018 and it's just been the... Tits. Thank you for tuning in to another week. I will see you on week 78. Farewell.
Love you, bye. Oh, that's good lighting. Ooh. I've not been focused this whole time. Oh, right, that's how I see it, but that's the one I wasn't sure about. Right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. When the vlogs go up, but oh, fuck, in here. Am I allowed to say bloody or is that a swear word? That's so ugly, too. Morning. Oh, I went to the radio. Did I tell you I was on, I'm going to be on Radio 1? I think, have you done it? Is it on? BBC Radio 1.